Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Chaos Rain here once again. Today I'm going to be going over how to imprint Regal and split an item. Now the reason you would want to do this is because you want to get, for example, this. This is Tier 1 Dictators. Dictators is a very hard pull to get on a sword, but what if you don't want to, you know, lose that? What if you want to, you know, craft on it, but you don't want to risk losing that roll because it takes a while to get? Well, thankfully, you can imprint it. Now, not only can you reprint it, or sorry, imprint it, you can also regal and split it. And uh, then apply the imprint after, potentially getting two of one item, such as the Dictator's Exquisite Blade. Or at least one Dictator's Exquisite Blade of Consumption, because the imprint and then the second one will be just that with that mod. Now this is a 50-50 roll. There is a chance that you will not get it and as such you have to be prepared that you know sometimes it's just the way it is. Uh, on average it is 50-50 but you can get a little bit you know I've, I've gone three or four split beasts without doing it. So I've already done the first step. I've already created an imprint now if you, if you see it says Dictator's Exquisite Blade of Consumption on the imprint, that's how you know it's right. See? Yeah, the same thing. So what this does is when I apply this to this, it'll create, it'll uh, reset it back to its original save state. So without further ado, let's, uh, let's go. First we have to regal from here, because it's already been imprinted, that's the first step. You regal here, and we didn't get anything cool, so we're not going to try and, you know, make a crazy item. Instead, we're just going to scroll down, split an item into two. Ooh, a little bit of lag. Gotta be careful. They do chaos damage. <coughs> Alright, what do we have? Oh, there we go. Now, as you see, we have two blades, right? Now, the blade that dropped has the Dictator's mod. What that means is that the blade here has, um, blade here is the original because it was in the thing. So I can apply the imprint and just like that, I have two blades with the Dictator's mod. Now, there's a couple reasons you would want to do this. The reason I'm going to do is I'm going to try and fracture it and uh, we can go and see if that pans out in this video. Um, I'll just go ahead and buy the craft, talk to this guy, whisper. Exquisite blade. <coughs> Invite to group. He's selling the fracture prefix for 3x. So I said, sure, I'll let him know when I'm ready. And I got lucky and got this done on first try. So let's go. Let's go see if we can't make a fractured exquisite blade. What you're doing here is you're locking in one mod, and when you lock in this mod, you basically make it so whenever you roll it, with any kind of rolls, reforges, anything like that, <coughs> you have a decently high chance to, uh, you know, well you guarantee your, your T1% fizz, obviously, but you have a chance to also get higher, you know, other fizzes make it a very, very strong exquisite play. I'm just going to craft random mana on here. Oh, looks like he got bugged. Uh, unfortunately on console we get what's called party bug to where we try to join a party and it doesn't work. <coughs> looks like he's already restarting. Oh, there we go. He's joined. Now normally what I do is I will bring along whatever feed it is they have and then I'll bring along a tip. So today I'll bring along 2x. I just spent so much x crafting my uh, newest I shot bow which is a really fun bow. <laughs> I just I just got through running a whole bunch of maps and it was fun. Waiting for him to go to his hideout. There. Oh, he came to my hideout. Oh, there we go. He went to his. It's warped player. Ah, <coughs> uh, here we go. 
trade player. Pay him up front, cause you know, just so he knows he's, you know, I'm not gonna walk away with his thing. Let's see if I get lucky today. This is three X used. Let's try and get a fracture, one split beast, and imprint. He says, "Yeah, GG." Oh, oh snap! There you go, buddy. Here's your tip. And just like that, we now have a crazy fractured exquisite blade with T1 Dictators. So our next step is we can 30 quality this and make something crazy. <laughs> Don't think my guildmates are going to be too happy that I made myself another new project but you know <laughs> it is what it is sometimes you get lucky and honestly it's a one in three chance to get it and it's a one in two chance to get the, imp the imprint i got lucky this time around don't expect to get lucky every time it won't happen but yeah that's how you m you make a really good base for you know fractured items and that's how those people get those thousand plus dps two-handed axes I hope this video was informative and helpful to anyone that is watching it. You guys have a good day. Take it easy.